In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to save clipped audio in under 20 seconds. That is a bold statement, under 20 seconds to save your clipped audio. In all honesty, I reckon we could do it in under 10, but first of all, let me show you how to do it, and then we'll see how quickly we can do it. So I picked up some new wireless microphones about a month ago, and I went straight out, out the box, and went to do some recording, make some short form content, not actually adjusting the settings, and not having a look at how far away I needed the microphones in my mouth, which meant in some heavily clipped audio, which sounds like this. Uh, this is just your sign that you should book that horrendous now in the past when this has happened I've had to just bin off entire pieces of content because I couldn't fix the audio But I have a solution and it is so easy. It's using two pieces of software First piece of software is Adobe Premiere Pro which we're only using because that's what I'm editing the video in The second piece of software is Adobe Audition both of these come together in the Adobe All App subscription This is my piece of content here. What we're gonna do is we're gonna right click on the track we're going to go up here to edit clip in Adobe Audition. This is then going to open up over in Adobe Audition. And as you can see, that is a horrendous waveform there. That, how clipped that is makes me feel ill. Then you're going to find the diagnostics panel over here. It's usually over here with like the media browser and all this stuff. I've not changed any of the default layout of uh, Adobe Audition. It just comes up over here. If it's not here, go up to window at the top and then you can select diagnostics. Make sure it's got tick next to it. Then you're gonna go over to the effect. We're gonna use D-Clipper because it's heavily clipped. And then there's four different things. You've got default, restore heavily clipped, restore lightly clipped, and restore normal. Nine times out of 10, I will use restore normal and it will be perfect for what you need to de-clip the audio. This is a horrendously clipped piece of audio. So we're gonna be using heavily, restore heavily clipped to fix this one. Underneath it, you can hit scan. That is gonna scan the clip for all the piece, all the parts where it believes it is heavily clipped. And then underneath that, you've got repair all. Click that and it takes three seconds, two seconds. And look at that waveform. That looks so much better already. Command S or Control S to save the clip. And then you're gonna go back over to Premiere Pro and give it another listen. Uh, this is just your sign that you should book that trip that you so much better. Obviously, it's not gonna be 100% perfect. It's not gonna be as good as if I'd got the settings right in microphone off the bat, but uh, that is now a usable piece of content, whereas before, there's no chance in hell I would have ever uploaded that onto any platform. I generally reckon I can do this in under 10 seconds. Obviously, Audition is already open, but we're gonna go. All right, start the, ti start the timer now. I reckon that was under 10 seconds. You sure about that? You sure about that? That must have been under, that must have been under 10 seconds. Come on now. That was so quick. That's what she said. <laughs> that is how you save your audio in under 20 seconds. I reckon it was under 10, but I'm not sure. Not, not 100% sure. I reckon it was under 10. But there you go. If you liked the video, if you found it helpful in any way, please put a thumbs up down below because it will push it out to other people looking for this sort of thing. Help them save their content. Subscribe if you want already, all the other stuff that YouTubers tell you to do, and I'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to take the shot. Peace.